if you see him, uh, he is armed. We assume he's armed. Uh, call 911 or contact your local uh, law enforcement agency. That's the Muskogee County Sheriff saying they're looking for this man you see right here, 24-year-old Andre Williams, who is accused of shooting into a trailer Thursday night, injuring a man inside. A toddler was in there too. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Shay Rossi. And I'm Sarah Whaley. Let's get to Fox 23's Amy Heibel. She's live in Muskogee County near 214th Street and Haskell Lake Road with new details on how this unfolded. Amy. Sheriff Andy Simmons says they responded to a call out here last night around 845. Now at this point in their in their investigation, it is early on, but they believe that Andre Williams shot into this trailer right here behind me. They say that at the time that this all unfolded, there were four people inside, including a child under the age of two. Six shots were fired into the trailer. A male was hit, shot three times. He was uh, transported to a Tulsa hospital. Is he expected to survive? Yes. Sheriff Andy Simmons says they are still searching for the suspect in the shooting, 24-year-old Andre Williams, who is described as a white male, approximately 5'7", weighing 140 pounds, with brown hair and hazel eyes. If you see him, you are asked to call 911. According to the Muskogee County Sheriff's Office, this all started as a dispute between Andre Williams, who then they say is the ex-boyfriend of the homeowner. Sheriff Simmons says Williams came to the trailer and was asked to leave. Simmons says that's when Williams went outside and fired into the trailer. There were four people inside at the time, including a child under the age of two. How fortunate is it that that little baby was not shot? It's very fortunate the child was not harmed. Now, if you see Andre Williams, this is the picture that the sheriff's office has published to the Facebook page. Again, you are asked to call 911. Now, we have learned that his car was recovered shortly after midnight in Wagoner County. We've also learned that an arrest warrant has now been issued. In Muskogee County, covering news that matters, I'm Amy Hyples, Fox 23 News.